These Netherite inhalers uh, have been getting lots of attention recently, but they are not as innocent as they look. Eh. Watch out, uh, cause they might be the new e-cigarettes. Eh. So, so, aso, uh, many of us uh, are familiar with this. They can release stuffy nose, uh, but many other beings and aliens uh, just put them uh, on their nose uh, for some reason. Uh. It uses menthol, uh, and so uh, it's safe uh, since it's from a mean plant. Safe if you just inhale normally and uh, not inhale them with oxygen. Uh. So, for those in hundred inhalers that you read online, uh, the only difference is that it has two inhalers instead of one, so that you can stuff yourself and then be a supachi, right? No way. Eh. You see, before various articles about this came out, I also thought that these inhalers uh, are similar to Vicks, yeah? but I was wrong. Unlike Vicks, uh, they just try to make you feel like your entire nose uh, is on ice. Uh. These natural inhalers uh, aren't just that. Eh. They actually have many powerful creams, uh, which is why uh, they are also called energy sticks. And yes, it's because they claim to give energy. Like uh, serious creams uh, with serious energy. Eh. Some cream uh, that can make you stay awake. Some cream uh, you can clean your liver and hack. Uh, some cream, uh, you can regenerate uh, lung tissues. Yeah. Now we know ovary secret. Uh, like, <laughs> you see, some of the creams uh, are outrageous, but that's not the worst. Yeah. What's concerning uh, is that for some of them, uh, the ingredients aren't exactly listed. Although they claim that it comprises mainly essential oils, natural ingredients, and plant-based extracts instead. Seems sad, right? Saying that, uh, it's like you tell your colleague uh, to help you tap out type, and then when he asks you what dishes you want, uh, you just look at him uh, and then say, Zeke, Naka, Zeke. Therefore, uh, experts are worried. Uh. According to research done by China, uh, some of the products may contain lead, miracle, menthol, and nicotine uh, that could be harmful to the respiration system and lungs. It's not verifiable, uh, but what's in the energy states are uh, unverifiable too. Ma. Another concern experts have, uh, it might lead to people using that like e-cigarettes, kind of like uh, how e-cigarettes replace traditional cigarettes. So it's like a gateway to smoking. Uh. Moreover, uh, here's the thing, it appears to target youngsters. Other than the super loud packaging uh, and a super low price of as low as $1.20 per energy stick, uh, two sellers have admitted to mainstream media today uh, that most of their customers are below 25, with some uh, as young as 12 years old. Eh. Now, if you're young uh, and have young friends, uh, you probably see your friends uh, using them as well. They can be found readily in Shopee or Lazada, and the quick search uh, will show that thousands of them uh, have been sold, with many are uh, being shipped from China. Over in Malaysia, uh, it has become such a big issue uh, that his health minister said that they are taking action soon and have urged people uh, not to advertise them. In fact, over there, uh, these energy sticks uh, are even sold in brick and mortar shops. Eh. Now, how about Singapore? Eh? Just last week, uh, MPs asked about it in Parliament uh, and it's revealed that both the MOH uh, and the HSA uh, are closely monitoring their use, paying extra attention uh, to its marketing on social media towards the young. A senior minister of state for health uh, said that they will continue to evaluate these products to ensure that they are not accounted with harmful ingredients such as nicotine as they evolve and will take necessary actions uh, to protect public health. There have also been calls to ban them, uh, but as of now, uh, there are many unknowns, so we just have to wait and see. Uh. In the meantime, uh, if you think you have learned something, uh, consider subscribing. Uh, and also watch this video uh, to be slightly smarter.